Stephen Carter here, your host, and I welcome you to our first episode of Healthy and Happy Senior Living. This show formerly was Safe Living Today, but being a senior myself and very concerned with health, happiness, well-being for seniors and for the people seniors love, family members, spouses, and so forth, I have changed the focus of this show, and we are now Healthy and Happy Senior Living. With each episode, I'm going to share stories, articles, studies, information that is relevant for seniors, as well as for those who are caregivers for seniors. This show will join other shows on my website at StressReliefRadio.com, StressReliefRadio.com. Sticking with the theme for healthy aging, a story in Medical News Today, headline, Study Identifies Unique Set of Attributes Linked to Healthy Optimal Aging. Summary, a recent study challenged prior definitions of what healthy or successful aging can look like by adopting a broader perspective To do so, researchers observed older adults in Canada and identified a unique set of attributes among people who age optimally. The researchers also assessed how well people age despite any chronic illness that may develop as they grow older. Here are some of the healthy aging attributes they've identified the ability to accomplish instrumental activities of daily living, freedom from disabling chronic pain, freedom from mental illness and memory problems, self-reported perceptions of happiness and physical health, adequate social support. All of these attributes really are vital according to a range of other research studies I'll have links to this story and all of the research information I share. You'll find those links in the show notes. Let's have a look at a story from Medical Express dated December 17, 2022. Short bursts of physical activity during daily life may lower risk of premature death. Lead paragraph. Most of us know that regular exercise is important for our health and longevity, but with our busy schedules, many of us struggle to find the time to fit in a workout. Data from our latest study has shown that you don't need a lengthy workout to get health benefits from exercise. Research revealed that as little as three or four minutes of short Vigorous activity bursts throughout the day were associated with a substantially lower risk of premature death from all causes compared with people who did none. This study involved more than 25,000 participants from the United Kingdom who reported they did not have any leisure, physical activity, or recreational walking more than once a week. Around 56% of participants were female, with an average age of around 62 years. The article goes on to describe the research methodology. This study, and many other studies I'm aware of, all point to the importance of physical movement, even if it's only a few minutes a day. Exercise of any kind really can make a difference in our physical, emotional, health, and, of course, even extend lives. Let's visit another study from Medical Express, December 19, 2022, headline, Loneliness Increases Risk of Premature Death for Those with Cardiovascular Disease Finds Systematic Review. New research from University of Limerick in Ireland has revealed that loneliness, social isolation, and living alone is associated with premature death for those with cardiovascular disease. Results from the new international study, just published in the Journal of Psychosomatic Medicine, 
found that people with cardiovascular disease that have higher levels of loneliness, social isolation, and that live alone tend to die prematurely. This article goes on to describe methodology and other related information. The takeaway here for us is to recognize the connection between psychological well-being and cardiac health, heart health. Whether we have a heart condition or whether we don't, whenever we feel a sense of loneliness or isolation, it is absolutely vital to reach out and connect with other people. That may mean family members, it may mean friends, it may mean contacting friends perhaps you haven't spoken with for years. It may mean engaging in activities in senior centers or even in your local restaurant. Activities, meetings, service organizations. It's vital for us to have social connection, social interaction. Let us go to the publication Medical Express, December 20, 2022, headline, Tis the Season for Home Holiday Hazards. Lead paragraph, the holidays are an exciting and busy time of year, whether you're traveling, hosting, or attending a gathering, or just cozying up at home, the holidays are filled with potential hazards that could ruin your holiday cheer. And they go on to identify some of those uh, hazards. Potential poisons can be found in every home. Decorations, plants, toys, and food are just a few of the many concerns the state's Poison Control Center has around this time of year. The dangers of some hazards like cleaning products and medicines are well known. Other hazards like carbon monoxide, disc button batteries, and small magnets hide in homes in plain sight. These are some of the suggestions that they recommend for holiday safety. One, give guests a safe space to keep potentially dangerous items safely secured including marijuana edibles, medicines, vaping, nicotine products, and hand sanitizers. Use caution with antique ornaments and those not made in the United States. These items may be decorated with harmful lead paint. Do not burn wrapping paper, foil, garland, and tinsel. Inhaling the fumes can be harmful. Decorate with plants that are not poisonous if you have young kids or pets. And I'll add grandchildren or other children who may be visiting you for the holidays or beyond. Many baking extracts contain high levels of alcohol. The same alcohol found in liquor, wine, and beer keep extracts out of sight and out of reach for children and pets. Snow spray... Snow spray should only be used in areas that have good air, good air circulation. Outside is, of course, best. Good air circulation to prevent inhaling potentially harmful fumes and it should be kept away from flames. Carbon monoxide. Carbon monoxide poisoning is a real thing. It kills hundreds of people every year and makes thousands more sick. Having working CO detectors on every level of your home is really, truly vital. If CO alarm sounds at any time, get out of the house right away and call for help. If you have questions, call your poison control center at 800-222-1222. Keep household items that have lithium discs, button batteries, also known as coin batteries. Keep those and small magnets out of sight and out of reach of kids and pets. Both are choking hazards and can cause serious and, sadly, irreversible damage to internal organs. Alcohol poisoning can cause serious illness and lasting health effects. Use simple food safety steps to prevent food poisoning, and they identify those steps. If you have pets in the home, 
Keep items dangerous to pets up high and out of sight and out of reach. Chocolate. Candy products containing xylitol, a sugar substitute. Bread, dough, fatty meat scraps, raisins, currants, alcohol, medicine, and recreational and illegal drugs. These items can cause serious health effects and, sadly, even death. The information that I've just shared is in the article, and it was provided by Rutgers University, New Brunswick. If you would like to be in touch, email me at cartermethod at gmail.com, cartermethod at gmail.com. Until our next visit together, your host here, Stephen Carter, wishing for you and your loved ones blessings in abundance.